What's going on guys? It's Enzone. Uh, I just randomly decided I wanted to make this video when I was eating a thing, a little rectangle of ShopRite sushi, and I was eating them casually, and the last sushi was right next to the wasabi, to the point where I picked up the last sushi and like half the wasabi went with it, and I wasn't paying attention because I was watching a YouTube video, and I ate that sushi, and my mouth fucking burned, and now I'm pissed off. And now I'm going to list a bunch of stuff I hate. What's wrong with you, bro? What the heck? You tripping, bro? People saying tomorrow when it's past 12, like you're hanging out with your friends and then it's past 12, right? And you have something going on technically that same day and someone goes, oh, later today, like you fucking nerd. Just say tomorrow. It's tomorrow when you go to sleep. It's not tomorrow yet. When me and my friends are going to go watch a movie, right? And then we're going to get tickets and they go, oh, we'll just get the tickets when we're at the theater. Like, you don't think that all the good seats are going to be taken? No, get the tickets now. What are you doing? Why are we, why are we waiting? When a game that's genuinely like fun to play gets ruined because it's old and corny and cringe and it's it's just associated with little losers like Among Us. Among Us was genuinely fun. I don't care. I Yes, I do still want to play Among Us. Why have we stopped? Why have we stopped playing Among Us? When a movie or a game comes out and someone just decides to post like a screenshot from the middle of the movie on their Instagram stories to, sh to show us that they, they went like fine. Like you can you can post on your Instagram stories. That, that you went somewhere or like, oh yeah, I went to go see this movie. Why, why are you posting a screenshot from the movie? Like, I don't want to see that. I'm about to go see it tomorrow. Or like when I'm in the middle of playing a game and somebody posts on their stories a picture of the credits. Like, like bro, I did not want to see the ending to Tears of the Kingdom yet. Like, I'm still in the middle of it. I'm looking at you, Lucas. Instagram comment sections. That's it. That's the whole stop signs on corners where I can't fucking see what's coming because there's a big ass van or something just on that corner where it's not supposed to be parked. Like, can you fucking move? I'm not going to gamble with my car. Overwatch 2. The whole game. That's that's it. How dusty my room gets. Like, I don't understand. There's like a dust spawner in my room. Like, my computer needs to be cleaned all the time. Like, and it makes it even creepier when you, you take into account that dust is made of like dead organic things, like dead skin cells, dust mites, insects. Yeah, I'm reading it off Google. That's kind of creepy. Why is that all over my room? Like when people tell me, wow, you have a loud keyboard. Maybe it's time for a better, more quieter one. Like no dumbass, it's meant to be loud. It's a mechanical keyboard. It's meant to be better than your keyboard. It's not your Apple keypad or whatever the fuck it's called. Playing Smash with someone who barely ever plays and getting spammed to death by some unreadable bullshit and getting told, wow, I beat you and I don't even play this game. Holy shit. This makes me want to throw my controller through the TV. Oh my god. My phone barely ever having any storage for anything because I thought, wow, I'm not going to take any pictures three years ago. Like, bro, little did you expect how many pictures you were going to take. And now I don't even like, sometimes I don't even have a gigabyte. I don't even have a gigabyte. Like, like my apps are getting uninstalled on their own because of how little storage I have for the phone to work. The fact the windows in my room are like two shutters so I can never fully open the window. It's always like only 50 percent open like it's either one side or the other my friend dylan not changing his discord profile picture like ever only to one day change it to a christmas version of the default discord profile picture as a joke and it's been that for the past two years straight when i have a video idea record the whole thing and then i'm editing it and i decide nah this is dumb as shit and scrap the whole thing. I don't know if this is gonna be one of them. Let's see, if you're watching this, then it wasn't, but I don't know. Impatient door dashers at my job, like do some of them not get that food needs to be made and we don't just magically spawn it in with like a fucking command prompt? Like when the video that took me the longest time to edit ever has the least amount of views on my channel. When the best picture I ever took gets the least amount of likes on Instagram. Like really? That shitty selfie in a Christmas hat has the most likes why fours of five just crashing that one time i was at the end of that long ass race i don't remember the name of the race i don't i don't remember who cares it, just, it crashed and i'm still kind of upset about it the sims 4 legit costing over a thousand dollars to actually get the full experience of the game 
who thought it was a good idea to sell a bare bones ass base game and a million dollars of DLC. When someone puts the Mude bot in a server you're in and you don't want to use it because the Mude bot is the stupidest fucking thing ever made on planet earth. Like I hate the Mude bot. It's so corny. It's so stupid. But no, I'm not going to let anyone else have Spider-Man. I'm going to get Spider-Man. So now I have to use the Mude bot and I hate it. It's so stupid. Anything going on on Twitter because I don't have and refuse to use Twitter because it gets me mad. It does every single time I open it. When a TikTok live likes to edge its viewers by barely accomplishing some goal, like he's almost there, but he never quite makes it. Like that one time I watched this guy cut open an egg but without breaking it open, and he took his sweet fucking time with that egg. My old middle school music playlist, like what the hell was I listening to? The fact that movie theaters made the better seats $2 extra, like who the fuck let them get away with that? Editor's note, um, apparently they just recently did away with this. I found out while editing the video, um, this was kind of surprising, although this is a big fat w so i dropped my nintendo switch like a month after i got it and like the joy cons kind of have this weird quirk now where they like slide off the switch without me having to press the button and it's like it's not to the point where like i'm using them in handheld and the switch just falls out but it's enough that i'm paranoid that it's gonna happen every single time i hold it bmws you not subscribing yes you specifically i can see you through the monitor all right, I think that's everything. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely more calm about the sushi now.